Hey, what is up guys? Johnny here back with another Call of Duty Mobile video. I finally reached legendary rank yesterday in Battle Royale and I wanted to share with you guys today the last game I played to get to legendary. But I also want to take a moment to talk about the game uh, and the bots in the game because I read a lot of comments on my YouTube uh, videos in the comments or on the live stream. Also, I read the Reddit and the Facebook and the social media as a Discord. There's a lot of talk about the bots in Battle Royale. A lot of guys seem to say Battle Royale is way too easy right now. This is full of bots and it's pretty much only bots. Well guys, I don't know about your experience, but I wanted, sh I wanted to share my experience with you guys today. Because in the last at least three weeks, uh, from Master 1 and up to Legendary, the games have a lot of real players, honestly. And all our games we played and if you watch my previous live streams we had real players and full squads of real players in all our games all our games every day so of course there's still a lot of bots and you will see in the replays and stuff there's still lots of bots because they want to like get the games to start fast and they want to fill the games but still there's a lot of real players and how do you know if it's a bot or real player well, I think so. I think that if they have cosmetics, usually a color backpack uh, or a skin, I guess it's a real player. The bots, I think they don't have, and correct me if, if I'm wrong, leave a comment below, but I think the bots don't have skins, right? Also, when you kill um, a player and you go for the loot, you'll see with the loot they carry. Usually the bots, they always have the same stuff. They have like one adrenaline shot, some shotgun ammo, and... Um, Usually they have the same weapon. They don't they don't carry the weapons that you find in the boxes. But also the real players, they have a lot of stuff, uh, much more than bots. They will have, uh, if you see the chip upgrade, it's not a bot. And uh, usually they have like four or five adrenaline shots and also the level three vest. I think the bots will not wear vest. And once again, like because of that, you can know it's, if it's a real player. But the way they move also, the real players they will play better they will move better um the bots usually they stand still and uh they will put the med kit in the middle of the street and they just stand there so yeah like i'll i'll leave you guys with the replay it was a cool game for real and i enjoyed the grind to legendary also i will say it's not that it's super hard to get legendary but it's, it's just very long it's a long long grind the last five levels from master one to legendary it's a lot of points and you only get like 20 points per win depending on how many kills you get but it's a long grind guys and um i don't know if we'll start again from scratch next season uh, we'll see at the start of next season i guess we'll have to wait less than two weeks now but i'll leave you guys with some replay uh enjoy the video and i will see you guys tomorrow take care that's why i'm really hesitant to play with real people when i play ranked because i think it's uh not an advantage until I get the AK, and once I have the AK, I don't care. I can try anything, because I got nothing to lose. Has something to do with the leader? Maybe. First blood. We'll try, we'll try something. But with Sanji, we'll just do the achievement for winning a game on casual because it's going to be easy. And then I'll play just solo with Kulda and see what kind of matchups we have. And if I'm the leader, I think we'll have maybe easier games. Because when Kulda is the leader, Kulda is like pro, pro something, pro four. What's your rank now, Kulda? Why he had a level three vest? The bots, do they do they grab the vest? I never know. Probably right. Pro four, nice. After pro is master, right? I think it's worth chasing master one for the the LMG. But I don't know if it's worth going for legendary after that because it's a very long grind. Alright, 
Let's go. Use an adrenaline shot now. It's not ready for master. It's too difficult. I don't know, man. From like, if you get if you get pro one easy, you'll get master one. But if you had a tough time getting to pro, you won't get master one. There's no point. It depends on your your skill a little bit. Cause seriously, my grind from from elite one to elite five was very very fast. I almost never play rank, and in three sessions, I I moved up like four ranks. Like I get like one rank, one session I had eight wins in a row. I moved from elite two to elite four in like eight games in a row. And last time I played, I got four wins in a row for like a hundred something points. So it's pretty fast if you if you do okay. Because even if I lose, like I said, when I play with randoms, I lose like three, four, five points. It's nothing. Because when I lose with randoms, I, I'm still the best player on the team often. Like I don't go one and eleven like these guys, you know. Like the randoms, sometimes they go like two and twelve, man. So you lose because of one guy, but you, if you're positive ratio, if you're MVP, I think you get more points. Yeah, once you get elite, no, once you get pro, you you start gaining less, right? Oh, there's a dude there. That was late. I right, just see where we want to go. We can go there. Damn it. They shoot the chopper now. El Gato? What do you mean, El Gato? Okay, so cool. That says my season goal is master, and next season legendary. Yeah, you need time. It's really long, I think. But if you play a lot of multiplayer, you'll get there even without trying. Oh, probably my capture card crash or something. It's not my capture card. I think it's my my adapter. Poor guy. Enemy eliminated. Use an adrenaline shot now. Airdrop has been delivered. Okay, okay, off kill if your stream keeps pausing, is because you're buffering. You need to you need to lower your settings, put it on 720p. It's your internet. Well, maybe my stream is lagging, but like I said, if you're buffering, try lowering the the settings. Maybe in 720. Okay, that's a real dude. You see how he was moving? That's not a butt, dude. Well, well, I don't know. He's using Chi and Striker. That's weird. He was moving super quick. The revived flight was Engaging the enemy. Use an adrenaline shot now. Use an adrenaline All right, so I still need to upgrade, guys. Okay, so stream crashed maybe also. Sometimes it's YouTube. The screen will just crash and and then it's gonna come back. There's a dude there. He landed on the ATV. War machine for Daz. Airdrop has been delivered. Uh, Come on, 
I cannot go down. Changing the enemy. What is going on today, man? So much. I keep healing. Let's go. Could be the weather. Could be. Super bots in the game. So what do we do? Go for the crate? I think I want the Arctic 50 exotic. I need 7.62. Maybe I can hook you up for the 7.6. Oh nice. Yeah, there's 30 in the box. And I'll drop you a few. I don't need that many. Uh, wait. I don't want to drop all of it. I don't remember how. Oh yeah, drop some. Okay. Chip terminal is almost. Enemy ready. is near. Never mind. Good. Last stunt. Roger that. No, but Wiggins, it's right that it's important to win, but your personal performance does matter. Because if you're the best player on the team, you gain more points than if you're the worst player on the team. If you go, if you go negative, like like one in five, you will lose points even when you win. At some point. But it's true that if you win, even if you don't do too good, you'll at least you get like 10, 10, 12 points. So winning is important. True, true story. Are you gonna open crate? Man, I don't know. I need to play multiplayer at least. I need to finish my, my challenges. I don't know if I want to open the crate. Freddy, doing great, thanks. Missing a lot of gear. Also, that was not Wiggins saying that. I don't know who said that. I thought it was Wiggins. But someone said about Ferg saying, when you, oh, it's, it's Manning. He said the, the only thing that matters is winning. So you should always play with the best players you know. But from my experience, if you're not a great, great player, if you play with full squads and you get match versus full squads, you're going to get destroyed. So you're going to lose. No, but it's okay. It's okay. Like, I think it's a great advice that, yeah, you need to win. So you should play with the best players. But I think what he says is if you're at legendary rank, you, you should play with best players because you're going to be playing versus full squads and you're going to be playing versus legendary players. So, yeah, you should play with the best players. But if you're at low levels, I don't know if it applies. If you're not a great player, maybe playing with randoms. With worse players, you're gonna score faster, I think. 
Yeah, legendary is different. I think that's the that's the difference. Because when you play legendary versus great players, you need to play with your best friends. Like, but on low ranks, it's different. The freaking drone, man, three times today is just not doing so good. The revive flight will arrive in one minute. The safe zone is collapsing. What do you think about Terrence Brooks? Dude, I want that skin so bad, I just can't get it, man. Super unlucky. Okay, maybe I'll open my blue crates at least today. Try to get Terrence Brooks. Down to the last five teams. Oh no, I dropped. A shot, dude. Alright, one guy remaining. Let's hunt. Oh, oh. Yeah, silence shots means real player. Oh, you got him, guys. Let's go. GG guys, the screenshot. Let's go, legendary. And I think I want to open my 32 blue battle crates right now. Yeah, 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 32 wins, let's go. Show Terrence Brooks. So many credits, dude. Oh no. I didn't get it. This is sad. That's a lot of credits, dudes. 150, 50, 50. And then what? Duplicate skins. XP card once. And I got that new yellow triangle grenade. Okay, three times 10. Let's go 10. You guys ready? What are we looking for here? Red action skins or April's full Skins, good luck. Not one by one. It's gonna be 10. Let's go, first 10. Ah, I got a vehicle skin, let's go. And I got the purple note, uh, the metal note backpack. Oh, nice. The headless rider back also. What? Blue Wave SR, ORV. Yo, shout out Samu, thank you for the sub. So I got like one, two, three, four five new skins here hey i like the green backpack guys this is pretty cool so two blue items here guys all right 10 more Ooh, april's full uh xpr i didn't have that too bad you can't give the extra away yeah i know right that would be so cool man so what we got here? Oh, the shark. So I got the shark parachute already. Now we got the, the shark wingsuit. So I could go full shark. Noise. And what was that? Oh, yellow snow arctic. Couple duplicates. All right, 10 more. Still no red action, guys. But the odds, like you need like hundreds of crates to get red action. Uh, it's the other April's Fool I want, by the way. Let's go red action. What tier level are you on for premium pass? 120 something. All right, let's go last 10, and then I'll do the solo one. Do one by one? Nah, sorry, bro. Not one by one. Last 10, and then one. Boo! This is rip. Nothing. 
except a few XP cards. And then the last one. Oh, come on. Duplicate 80 credits. So, dude, that's it, guys. That was a fail. And I'm at 24,000 credits.